Hey everyone, uh, if you're a poker player and you're looking to get some more information about the uh, players you're playing against, try to get an edge over them, try to understand how they play, why they do what they do, which will in turn make you able to play against them better, what you want to try and check out if you haven't yet is Shark Scope. So we've got our opponents up here, we're trying to figure out what kind of players they are. Well, we can search them up on a website that's free to use called Shark Scope. So if we look up this player right here, their name is Grinchy. We pull up our browser, go to sharkscope.com. So this is just the home page here. Click here in the middle to search and we type in Grinchy. And you'll see it'll pull up every player uh, on different sites with the name Grinchy in it. We're looking for Grinchy on Poker Stars. And it loads it up. And what we can see here is that this is a pretty good player. They've been playing since 2007 casually, uh, but they've got 11,000 games, over 11,000 tournaments. Their average stake is $12 Canadian. They have a positive ROI and they've made 13,000 Canadian profit. And you can see recently over the last two years here, their graph has just been going up, 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 and they've been winning consistently. So this Grinchy player is a good winning player. So when you're playing against them, you want to keep that in mind that they're not spewy. They are a good winning player. So uh, that's just something that will help you understand the person that you're playing against better. Now, this graph here is not always visible. Uh, this requires users to opt in. Opting in is free. Uh, you'll see up the top here also, we only have four searches remaining. So we have five free searches each day, and that's tied to your IP. Uh, so if you do use a VPN, sometimes you can get some extra free searches, but uh, they do have uh, some premium plans available that'll give you more searches and some other tools, advanced filters. You can reset your statistics if you want to uh, hide that. Um, you can also opt out if you don't want your statistics to show publicly that's pretty important for a lot of people that just want to play casually um, or even pro players a lot will do it because they don't want people to either uh, see what their stats are or see their swings let's just pull up another player here so we'll open our tables and we'll choose somebody with an easy name to search up what's this one uh these are all hard names caduce cadu.67 let's see here cadu.67 there we go. So you'll see it's not opted in. 65 ability, so not as strong of a player likely as Grinchy, but still not bad. Uh, anything over 60 is not not the worst player. Uh, over 70 is usually a winning player. 65 can still uh, be not a winning player, but um, you can look into the statistics, try to get some more ideas. Uh, 6,000 games means they've been playing a long time. Uh, average stake, they're quite a bit lower than Grinchy, so uh, only $7 here for their average buy-in in tournaments on PokerStars. And you can see things like winning days, losing days, break-even days, uh, are they playing mostly turbos, a lot of information that you can get in the money percentage, how much rake they've paid, like there's a lot of information here. First time they played was 2009. So it's a good website, it's free to use. If you want to sign up for a premium account, you can get extra searches. And what you want to do to really maximize the benefit here is when you search someone up, just go back to go back to your table and add a little note on them there so that uh, you don't forget that and you can use that later. When you're playing against them, you don't have to search them up over and over and use up your credits. You can just quickly hover your mouse over and maybe update it every two years or something like that just to see if the player has gotten better or worse. But uh, other than that, yeah, it's a good way to, to add to your notes, add to your tools to try and improve your poker abilities. So that's sharkscope.com. I'll add a link in the description. Free to start with. Check it out. Bring your poker up to a next level. Have a good day, guys, and good luck on the tables.